What's going on fanatics? This is Chris Williams here with CycloneFanatic.com. Just taking a little stroll by Sun Devil Stadium here. It's about 1 o'clock Arizona time. Day before kickoff, Cyclones and the Gophers coming up tomorrow. Hey, this little video brought to us by Planet Sub. Stop in and get a sub. Even have it cater your bowl party coming up on New Year's Eve. Just got done doing the uh, press conference. Coach Paul Rhodes and Tim Brewster speaking with members of the media. Uh, interesting things. It was actually more, there was more substance in that press conference that I had anticipated. Uh, usually members of the media kind of look at an event like that as just a lot of fluff. Uh, but the both teams, I was really impressed with both teams. I thought that they're really approaching this football game. It, it just seemed more serious than I, I guess I thought it would be going into it, especially I think for the Minnesota side, uh, just because I'm more familiar with Iowa State, I'm very familiar with uh, the nuances of you know Nate Frere and Reggie Stevens and and obviously head coach Paul Rhodes. I, I, I kind of expected uh, what I what I saw with them, but Minnesota, you know. Uh, we keep hearing a lot of, well, uh, how much do they want to be here? I think they actually want to be here a little bit more than a lot of Cyclone fans and maybe media members have given them credit for. Uh, Brewster's extension at the beginning of the week, I think that it, it kind of put a spin on this football game for Minnesota is where this is the first game of next year type of deal. That's, just, that's, that's kind of what I keep getting from Minnesota. The, the more I'm around this program here. And I just don't see the Gophers rolling over and dying, Fanatics. I, I still think Iowa State will win. I, I'm going to stick with a three-point victory for the Clones. But uh, I just, I don't know. I think Minnesota's going to be a little bit more focused and ready to play ball than a lot of people are thinking. Uh, been a good time down here. You can Iowa State's actually going through their walkthrough right now, the team is. And I'm going to scroll over here. I'm not sure if you can see it over these vehicles. I'll kind of walk over there as well. But there are a lot of Cyclone fans gathered. To, you know, they knew that the team was going to walk through right now. So, of course, the Cyclone Nation over here gathered. And they're going to ready to cheer the team on after they get through their final walkthrough at Sun Devil Stadium. Right now you're looking at some vehicles that I'm sure you don't really care about. As I can kind of move over here and I'll try and show you the crowd of Cyclone fans that are gathered here on Boy, my days are all turned around. I guess it's Wednesday afternoon. But it's been a good trip so far. Uh, looking forward to the football game tomorrow. We're going to have a lot more content for you at Cyclone Fanatic. Also want to remind everybody that uh, KXNO 1460 uh, and KXNO.com are going to be having eight hours of Cyclones tomorrow, uh, all pregame. Uh, Matt uh, Peralt and Ken Miller and myself are going to be on for three hours. Uh, we're going to lead you right up to kickoff. Uh, the Insight Bowl that you'll be able to hear on KXNO as well. So stay tuned to that. We'll break down every inch of this football game along with John Miller. Uh, he'll start the day off and then Keith and Andy as well. But there's your Cyclone fans over there. Pep rally coming up tonight at Rawhide. It's this like western town uh, that's out by the team hotel. That'll be a whole lot of fun as well. Um, I'm going to sign off now. Keep checking out CycloneFanatic.com. We couldn't do it without you. Uh, thanks a lot, Fanatics. Wish you were down here with us, and uh, hopefully we'll see you at a bowl game next year. I already made the prediction. I'm actually, I rode here with John Walters, voice of the Cyclones, and Eric Murphy of ABC5, and I just made the prediction for the New York Yankee Bowl next year. Iowa State Rutgers. Mark it down. We'll be in the Big Apple on New Year's Eve. Thanks a lot, Fanatics. Have a good day. Signing off, I'm Chris Williams.